Hello everyone, let's take a look at our next problem. A farmer wants to fence an area of 1.5 million square feet in a rectangular field and then divide it in half with a fence parallel to one of the sides of the rectangle. How can he do this so as to minimize the cost of the fence? Okay, so the first thing I'm thinking right away is I'm gonna be drawing a picture. Um, I'm gonna be drawing something that's rectangular uh, and there's going to be a line segment which divides it in half. Um, and we're gonna be minimizing the cost of the fence. So obviously we'll probably assume that the cost of the fence is proportional to the length of the fence. Um, I'll set up a little bit of a coordinate system. Um, I'm gonna set up a coordinate system and we're gonna have a variable which represents the length in some dimension of this rectangular field. And we're going to minimize the total length of this, uh, you know, geometric figure uh, as a function of that one coordinate. Okay, so let's get started. Let's just draw a rectangle to begin with. Um, and you know, as part of uh, part of the problem says that we're going to divide this field in half with another length of fence which is parallel to one of the sides. Now, of course, um, we're not going to divide it in half like this. Uh, it's more efficient to divide it in half like this, right? Okay, so what I'm going to do is, in terms of my coordinate system here, or, uh, you know, parameters involved, uh, let's denote the lengths, uh, the, or the, the width and length of this field by x and y. Um, in the problem, it says that the total enclosed area of this field is 1.5 million square feet. So let's just call this 1.5. Uh, we'll work in, well, you know, the, this is being squared. So in fact, let's just keep it uh, in proper units here. 1.5 times 10 to the six. So of course this means that X is equal to 1.5 times 10 to the 6 divided by y. Actually, it'll be easier to write y in terms of x. We're going to eliminate y by making the substitution. Uh, and we'll use x as sort of our um, uh, the variable of throughout our problem here. OK. Um, so we'll drop down this dividing piece of fence, which of course also has length of x. Uh, so now if we write out the total length of fence involved here, it's 3x plus 2y. We'll call this uh, L. Um, and then what we're going to do is we're going to substitute this expression that we have for y in terms of x. We're going to put that in here so that we have L only in terms of x. And to make it obvious that L is now a function of x, I'll write it like this. 3x plus 2 times 1.5 times 10 to the 6 divided by x. Okay, so for any choice of the variable x here now, the, um, you know, the vertical dimension of our field, um, we have the total length of fence involved to enclose the field and divide it in half with this, this additional piece of fence. Um, and at this point, we're really just going to, we've reduced this to a pretty standard calculus problem now. Um, remember, ultimately, what we're trying to do here is minimize the length of the fence. Um, so to do that, we now have this uh, simple function of x. We can take a derivative and set it equal to zero. Uh, we'll probably also have to check, you know, endpoint constraints, make sure that, you know, values of x equal to zero and values of x equal to infinity don't really apply. Um, you know, I would expect that this to all just work out properly. Um, I expect this to all just work out properly without needing to check um, endpoints or anything like that. Okay, so there's the derivative of the length with respect to x. We want to set this equal to zero. 
And this is going to give us that x squared is equal to 10 to the power of 6. Just a little bit of algebra and some, calc and some cancellations. And so x is 10 to the 3. Um, so of course this gives us y also, which is 1.5 times 10 to the 3. Okay, so that'll be our answer. Um, this vertical dimension of the field should be a thousand, and this horizontal dimension of the field should be one and a half thousand. Um, you can obviously check that the area, of course, is 1.5 million square feet, um, and this will happen to minimize the total length of fence involved. Nice, simple problem.